Good morning, everyone. Today I figured I would do a what I eat in a day like intuitive eating um, because that's what I've been doing lately and it's actually been helping me lose weight without constantly counting calories and all of that. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. And, sorry, I was looking at my water. Let's get into it. So the first thing I have in the morning is um, this apple cider vinegar shot it has ginger and honey i've started doing apple cider vinegar shots i literally just started doing them this week it's thursday so not that long um but i will do one shot literally i fill up my shot glass and um then i add it into water which i don't know how much water this is but it's like part of this red cup like to the second line i believe um because I did take it like just by itself at first. And a lot of people told me that um, it's actually really bad for like your esophagus and your teeth. So mix it with water or green tea. And I'm gonna make my oxy shred that I have every morning, um, which you guys have seen like all the time in like all of my eat, what I eat in a day videos. But um, now I do it a little bit differently. One scoop of the oxy shred this flavor is pink grapefruit i don't know why i got grapefruit flavor i hate grapefruit but i guess in my head i was thinking you know it's artificial grapefruit flavor here's one scoop i know it's a little heaping scoop but that's just what i do um with the grapefruit i was like it's artificial grapefruit so it'll probably taste sweeter than what a real grapefruit tastes like and it doesn't but it's not unbearable i guess and then I just take this, this is the acetyl carnitine. I don't know if I'm saying that right at all, but this is kind of like another thermogenic like fat burner. Um, you can take up to five little of these scoops a day. I usually just do one or sometimes I'll have a second one in the middle of the day if I'm feeling tired. It helps with energy and all that and also burning fat and it's a really good like stack together. And I feel like it's been helping me with my weight loss as well. I'm gonna drink this and then I will see you guys whenever I eat breakfast. now and I'm going to make my breakfast this is the breakfast that I have pretty much every day it's just one egg but I think I'm gonna do an egg and an egg white um, these peppers that you guys just saw me cut up a little bit of onion because this is about to go bad so I want to use it um, tiny bit of this vegan mozzarella and then this bread that you guys have seen before the 647 bread it's 40 calories per slice and I just have one piece of that Oh, yeah. It's breakfast. It's breakfast.
that it really needs it, but... because I still feel a little bit hungry and I'm tired so I need some caffeine um, same coffee that I usually do this is the unsweetened dark roast iced coffee um, the Starbucks one I really love Dunkin Donuts coffee I love going there but um, it's just not the healthiest so I do it at home instead and it saves money and then this is the Silk Almond Milk Creamer, the flavor caramel. Um, the last one that you guys saw, if I had coffee, it was the Sweet and Creamy Almond Milk one. Um, but I wanted to try the caramel this time. And stay up. coffee and then I will probably see you guys at the gym maybe I'll get Brian to record a little bit of my workout for me upper body day if not then I will see you guys after the gym. all right guys so we are about to head to the gym again it's upper body day um figured I would show you the pre-workout I use it's called Athena it's by Unico I think is how you say it um this is a flavor strawberry margaritaville I usually just dry scoop it but today, maybe I'll take it with a little bit of water. Yeah. So yeah, usually I dry scoop it, but today I'll just take it with some water. Also, I'm wearing my new navigation leggings. They're super bright and fun. Yes. All right, you guys, so we left the gym probably about 20 minutes ago. We came to Walmart to get a couple of things, which I think I might have told you guys I was going to do, but I don't really remember. Um, now we are on the way back home and I was craving fries. So me and Brian are going to share a large fry and then we're both going to have a salad for lunch. Um, so large fry. That's the best thing about in like intuitive eating is you can kind of eat, not can eat whatever you want, but I guess I would more so call it the 80, 20. Is that what it's called? I think that's what it's called. When you eat like 80% whole foods and all that healthy stuff and then 20% is whatever you want. And me and Brian sp splitting this large fry is my 20% for the day. So. I will see you guys at home for lunch. The fries filled me up to be honest um again me and brian split a large fry but i'm just gonna have a protein shake this is the apollo from the same brand that i actually have the pre-workout from um unico i think is how you say it this is the cinnamon roll protein oh my god i'm almost out already yeah um one scoop i think it's like 100 something calories oh. 120. I need to order more. I have like two servings left, but yeah, cinnamon. Well, it's called ooey gooey cinnamon rolls or something like that. It's really good. 
tastes like vanilla ice cream to me with cinnamon in it. Brian thinks it tastes like horchata without something in it. I think he's confused with the vanilla chai blessed protein is what he's thinking about. But it's really, really good. So yeah, I'm just gonna have this and then I'll probably have the salad with my dinner because it was really good last night. So I think we'll keep the salad with me. So we'll see. I made myself a drink. Yes, an alcoholic drink. I'm 22 years old. I have one <laughs> drink. I usually allow myself like one to two depending on how I feel. But I was thinking about it in the shower and the bath and I was like, I want to stop drinking again because I did that for like a month and it felt really good for me. So, yeah, it is a lot of extra calories, like my mom just said. So, um, yeah, I'm hot in this. I just took a shower and a bath, so that's probably why. I just didn't want my stomach go out. Hopefully, you guys can't see my nips. That would be awkward. Maybe I'll just hold it like this. Um, so, yeah, I'm looking a bit of a mess because I just got out. But I was thinking in there, I was like, I want to stop drinking again because that really helped my weight loss for that month. It literally helped me lose like five pounds and it just makes me feel good when I don't drink. So starting tomorrow, I won't be drinking anymore. So I'm going to have probably two or three today. So yeah, um, just my one drink. It's coconut rum, um, mango vodka, a little bit of grenadine orange juice and pineapple juice. And it's really, really good. You guys should try it if you guys like to drink, if you guys drink at all, if you're 21 and up, okay? So for dinner, we're gonna have pizzas, which I think you guys have seen me make before. This is like something that I make all of the time. Um, a lot of nights, literally like three, four, maybe even five nights a week. Um, super easy and really good. <laughs> So for Brian's, I ended up using just vegan chicken just because I was lazy and didn't want to use two pans and have to clean them. Um, but Brian's okay with either really. So not that big of a deal, but what's probably gonna be it if I see you guys again, then so be it, but I probably won't because I'm really not that hungry. And this will definitely fill me up, but thank you so much for watching. As always, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one.